What's going on everybody? Caesar here with Z1 Gaming. So this is kind of a different video as you can see. Um, I just got home and I got some things. We went out shopping with the family. So we're gonna go check some of that stuff out. Um, I'm gonna hop to the office real quick and we're gonna do this. Oh. Alrighty, so here we are in the office now. That was much easier. Oh, there. See? Ah, I can see now. Okay. Um, so, we went to the store just doing stuff, like daily stuff. This is completely out of the realm of what I do. So, um, But I got a few things. I was like, you know what? I'm just going to show you what I got. Because it could be exciting for somebody. I don't know. Maybe. Um, got some unexciting things first. So, we're going to do those first. And then we're going to do like the cooler, I guess, exciting stuff. So, a couple of this actually has to do with the stream that I'm doing tonight as well. Um, I'm streaming across that. But I'm going to try something different. Now... If you follow my channel at all, you'll remember in the previous videos that I bought one of these. And I actually took it back, the C922 Pro Stream. Bought one, took it back because it didn't have software. Well, I'm doing it again. I'm trying it again. Because, like, this is this is the one everybody likes. This is the one that everybody uses. So, we're going to try it again. I don't care what quality it is. We're going to roll with it once. We're going to see how it goes. So, bought that. Well, there was a problem last time uh, when I was trying to use this thing. And that's my lighting, because you can see I have a window right here. And actually right now in front of it, there's a there's like a, a sound panel thingy I made. Um, you can kind of see like this one that I made. It's just out of like a little foamy stuff on a boom stand that I got with the microphone right here. And I don't use a boom stand. So um, that's actually blocking out a lot of light right now, believe it or not. Well, yeah, it is. It really is. Um, but the, the light from my face wasn't good. So I bought this thing. Um, it's a little, it's like a little lamp deal. And I have plans. I have plans. Uh, we're gonna want to open it up real quick. And um, there's no tape even on it. I don't need a knife for anything. Oh my gosh. Um, okay, let me open this up and I'll show you what it is real quick. Ah. Cool. All right. So lamp on a clamp. Lamp on a clamp. Look at that. Um, I'm gonna make this like my face light. Uh, so you can see my face better, but there was another problem. I was like, well, this was only like $14, I think from uh, Home Depot. Um, it just turns on and off and it uses a regular light bulb. So I was like, well, I don't want just regular light shining like right here in my face. Like I'm recording like, you know, really, really bright. But so I got this, but then I bought this thing, uh, smart LED bulb. I don't know. It was like. $14, $15 maybe. Um, but you can control it like through an app. I don't know, like, it has like a little flappy panel. It's so cool. Um, it has like an app that you control it on and you can like dim it, make it brighter, you know, things like that. So that I think is going to come in very, very handy. We're gonna try this. I'm gonna try hooking this up tonight. Um, I'm not gonna do it right now, but you'll see in the stream. If you follow my stream later, you'll see it. Um, but we're gonna try this, see if it works. Okay, so that's cool, that's cool. Um, Got this, got another webcam, I'm gonna try it again, you know. And then, okay, so, the cool thing, where's the cool thing at? Hold on, I'm gonna have the cool thing with me, I left it out there, hold on. All right, so, the cool thing. This is the cool thing, I was so excited, like, I, I saw this, I was so excited. Um, It is a Nintendo Switch backpack. Now, there's a story, kind of, I went and I got a messenger bag, they have like this messenger bag thing, for the Switch, where everything like fits in it all nice. You can take like the dock and the Pro Controller and like your cables, everything you need for the Nintendo Switch. I was like, that's so cool. So I wanted one. I was like, well, I'm gonna be carrying this because I'm, I'm actually going to California in a couple weeks. So my intention was to carry it on a plane because you know, bring the Switch with you on a plane. I'm not gonna check that. Are you crazy? But then the guy was like, oh, we also have a backpack. I was like, well, let me see the backpack. I want to see what it looks like. They showed it to me. I was like, oh, cool. It just looks like a regular backpack, but it's not. It's not just a regular backpack because first you do have your pockets. We need pockets for things. Uh, here's the tags for it. I was actually wearing it around after I bought it because it's the best way to carry a backpack, right? It's on your back. Um, so I got this. It has like a tablet pocket right here. You can see a little little tablet emblem right there, um, which is cool. I was like, oh, that's neat. You know, whatever. Then it has like this bigger pouch out here. It has like a headphone emblem right there. I guess you can put your headphones or whatever. Um, or a laptop. Laptop stores. That's, that's why I like that. I was like, well, that's cool. And then, then the money. This, where's the thing? There, the money right here. 
It has dedicated spots for each Nintendo Switch thing. It has your Switch, your Pro Controller, it has three Joy-Con slots. And then down here, I don't know if you can see that very well, it has a spot for your dock. And then there's like a pouch, a pouch on the very, very bottom for like the miscellaneous cords that you should mind, stuff like that. So, um, yeah, I was like super excited because I was like, I bought this messenger bag and I just, I returned it immediately and got this instead because this allows me to carry my Switch, which I can play all the time because I love the Switch. It's like my favorite console of all time. I love consoles, but I do PC gaming and I, in the future I might do like console gaming and I, I really want to, like especially for the Switch because I like it so much. Um, but this backpack was like, I was like, I, I gotta have that. Um, I think this is... $49.99. Pretty sure it's $49.99. Um, but like I said, I was going to I'm tra traveling to California in like two weeks, I think. So I wanted to be able to carry everything with me on there. Um, so videos are going to slow down. I'm sorry. Videos are going to slow down on my channel. If you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe as well if you want to see more stuff. You know, I, knew, I normally do gaming videos and things like that. So, um, but yeah, I'm going to put stuff in here. I'm not going to put like the dock and everything because I don't, I don't want to take it all apart. Um, I have it on my desk right here with me like it's like literally right there um right there yep look at that oh let's play minecraft i like minecraft i play minecraft i'm playing it on here so well, let me just show you real quick let's just stuff it in here and see um so this little pocket they all have little velcro dealios on them now i'm guessing it will be meant to put it with the joy cons on it I, you know it's actually kind of funny that they have so many joy con spots there's six but that's because I'm releasing all these different colors of Joy-Cons and I'm gonna have to have them all anyway. So like neon yellow ones are coming out with arms, which I'll be buying. And I'll be buying those yellow neon ones. And this Splatoon 2 is gonna have like neon pink and green ones. So cool! Um, but yeah, this guy just goes whoop, like that. And well, bam, look at that, perfect spot. Good to go. And then the Pro Controller, actually I can throw a Pro Controller in there too. So of course you have to have the Pro Controller. I mean, if you're playing in any console mode, Pro Controller all the way. The, the Joy-Cons and the other deal thing. Look at that. Perfect. You know what? Maybe it should go the other way. I don't know. That fits perfectly though. I mean, like, look at that. You can't even, like... Oh. That's perfect. And they have all this room for activities. Um. Now, also, you know what? I'm just going to go through my Switch accessories right now because I know people are probably going to ask me, like, what Switch accessories do I have? And uh, I'm just going to show you right now. But obviously I have the stuff that it came with um, and a Pro Controller. Because Pro Controller, I mean, you have to have Pro Controller. Um, and then, I also have this deal. It's a hard case. Um, and I like that. I bought that originally because I was like, well, if I'm going to carry it places, like, locally, like, around, you know, you're just going somewhere or whatever. This is cool to bring. I'll probably be bringing the backpack, though, because you can throw the, like, the charging cable in there. Well, that's where the messenger bag might come in handy. If you're just going somewhere, like, close by, you don't need everything. The messenger bag might be the way to go. It was only, I think today it was $34.99 because it was pro days. Um, but, so I have this thing. If you've ever seen it, uh, it doesn't come with this. Hold on, I'll show you that in a second. Um, comes with uh, this thing. Looks like this. Has this little padded thingy to put stuff in. And it, like, it velcros down. And it's like a pad to cover the screen. And then it comes with uh, two cases for your games. So you can see I have, what is that? Legend of Zelda in that one? Yep, got that. Cool, put it in there. And then I also got this. This is like one of the greatest accessories it is. It is this like leathery thing. It's from it's from Nintendo. They made it. And what it does is basically let me put it on here so you can see what I'm what I'm talking about. Super easy to put on too. Like grab the switch out. Boop. I'm gonna pull this off. Put this guy on here. Like come on. Like that. Put this guy back in here, like so. Look at that. That was like the Nintendo Switch click. Um, and then it opens up, and it's like this leather case that go, kind of goes over it, uh, protects it, but it becomes a stand. It has like notches, so it'll sit there like that. Because the kickstand on this thing is garbage. Oh my god, it's so bad. Um, but yeah, so there's that. And then. Also, I have the screen protector, like the number one screen protector on Amazon, like the one that everybody buys, it's, I don't know, tempered glass thing. I have that on here as well, which is absolutely highly recommended because, you know, I mean, it's a $300 portable console. Well, I want to protect the But yeah, so protect the screen, it's good. Um, and then this actually fits into this with it on there. That's kind of why I got it. Like I bought both because I wanted one or the other. And lucky for me, look at this. Just goes in here, sits flat. This guy 
close it down on there, and then whoop, a little Velcro thing. Bam. Fits. Perfect. Good to go. Ooh, I like it. Thumbs up for me. Um, but I wanted the backpack because I'm traveling and I want to bring the dock. I want to bring everything with me. Now, you can buy docks like separately now. Uh, they're like $90 just for a flipping, like a USB hub, essentially. It's just like a type C USB hub, HDMI out, a couple of USBs, and that's crazy expensive. They need to make something. I've seen people do it themselves. They cut out the block, the little the block, like it's literally a two inch block on the back of it. They cut it out and then they make a portable thing out of it. They, Nintendo needs to just make that so other people don't make it and just start making money off of it because just make it now and be done with it because everybody will buy that because it's so much easier to carry a block this big around places and your power supply and HDMI cable and all this stuff than it is to carry the entire uh, the dock around because that's crazy. So, alrighty. Um, what else? Like, this this video was completely random and I didn't, I wasn't planning on doing this. I just was like, you know what, let's try it. Let's see how it goes. Um, but, I mean, I guess I could show you around a little bit. I mean, I guess if you really want to see the, the stuff, um, I'll just, let's, here, hold on, let's put this knife away. I never put it away. It's bad. Um, so, this guy's going to go back on the stand because, I mean, I'm not leaving yet, so I don't need to pack it away. But, yes, this backpack, I love this thing. Probably taking it with me everywhere now. It's so amazing. Um, okay, so let's go, and I'm just gonna show you around a little bit. You know, like the office, my office, which actually is the second bedroom, or third bedroom, and I have family coming down, so it's gonna get switched into bedroom status. But like my desk and all this stuff right here, like you'll see, my whole thing is divided. Like this is my like work area that I like to work in, and then this is like the rest of my office nerd stuff. But it could be turned into a bedroom if it has to be. So let's get into that. Let's look. Let's look at stuff. Let's look at stuff. Okay. So we're moving now. Don't get seasick. Um, okay. So oh, let's go like this. I want to show you my desk first. Okay. So we have nothing over here. This is a terrible mess. Right here. Yeah, let's do that. My fan is literally like right there, and I'm trying not to hit it with the phone. I'm recording this on my phone, by the way. Um, this is actually a server that my friend got me, and I've just been playing with it. I don't really know what to do with servers, so. Trying to like figure out how to run a Minecraft server maybe or something like that. Um, monitor things like that. I have this box right here. Ooh, airplane pillow. Um, it's full of games, like old consoles and things like that. Cause I, I have like, I have most of the old consoles and I'm trying to collect them and I'm trying to get a NES Classic Mini, the, the new NES Classic thing. I'm trying to get that because I love it. But golly, they're so expensive, like $250 for them. No way, not happening. Um, so this is a mess over here. But then, like right here, I have these stools. They're Star Wars, because you know, everybody knows I like Star Wars if you watch my channel at all. Star Wars, or Stormtrooper Darth Vader. I have this guy, some Doctor Who stuff. Huge Doctor Who fan. Huge Doctor Who fan. And then, um, um, oh, the Minecraft thing. Oh, Minecraft, little torch deal right there. Um, but yeah, so, okay. Now, what else we got? Um, some art that my wife made me. And then we also have some little Star Wars figurines and these little guys. These were actually McDonald's Happy Meal things. How cool is that? Okay. Uh, this stuff, this stuff, and then cool. So we got some things. Now this guy made this guy by hand. Well, I homemade it. It's a uh, garment rack, I think, for like 20 bucks from the thing. And then this like foamy stuff was from Walmart for like eight bucks. So it's like a, a bed liner thing, I think. But this is what I put right behind me when I like recording stuff like that because it echoes really bad if you don't. And you can see like this wall has nothing on it. Like it has pictures, but guess what? They're hard surfaces and they bounce off and it's just terrible. Um, so that's kind of just over here for now. And then I have this thingy right here, which is like um, another sound thing. So, okay, let's look at the desk. Let's look at the desk. I guess you guys talk me into it. Okay, so here, is my desk. Um, first of all, I have a 40, I think it's a 40, 40 inch 4K TV. It was on sale, it was like 250 bucks from Walmart as well. I got that to put it here to play the Switch on. I know it's overkill, but it's kind of actually harder to find a cheaper 1080p TV now than a 4K TV because they're just like everywhere now. Um, but okay, let's switch this around real quick. Okay, so that's better. 4K TV that'll play the switch on, which normally sits in here. Um, 
two monitors, 1080p. I don't do 4K stuff like that. Oh, it's kind of blurry. Don't don't do this. Don't do this to me. Uh, my keyboard. It's a Ryan Spark G910. Is it? Yeah, right there. See? I don't know if you can see that. G910. Um, I have my mouse, which is back here. Boom. Razer Naga Epic Chroma. I don't know. It's like 50% off, so I got it for a pretty decent deal. Uh, this G13 uh, gamepad, which I use for like editing and Premiere because I can make all these like hotkeys. I can just do like, I can edit super fast. Like, and then um, Audio Technica AT2035 XLR on a boom arm. That was cheap from the Amazon for like $10. Some off brand thing. That's going into my. There's my helmet. Uh, that's going into my UX2. 16UX2. This is what I use to like. Um, it's made for like music and guitars and stuff like that. But I use it to like noise cancel and stuff like that behind my voice and clean up things. So like the audio on this is not gonna sound as good because this is through my phone, as opposed to going through this thing. You, the audio is a crazy difference. PlayStation controller that I use through my computer. Um, here's my computer. That's ASUS, lots of everything, uh, 1080 in there, two ter just, I have my specs on my about page if you really want to see it, and then I have an Ikea desk, um, oh, and I also have that little power supply, that guy right there, um, yeah, Ikea desk, it's the long one, it's like the long one with the Alex thing, like, you can see all these drawers are just, like, full of everything, oh, here's that, this thing, this thing is terrible, um, like, this thing isn't terrible, it's, it works, but, like, th it's just a weird design to hold the switch, so, um, but yeah, that's pretty much like my setup, like what I see every day. I bought this tag for when I go. Not the bag you are looking for. <laughs> that's funny. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Oh, I also have this uh, Star Trek poster right here. Of the Enterprise like blueprint thing. It's pretty cool. I like Star Trek too. I like everything. Like I'm just like a nerd like that. I like everything. I like everything gaming related. So um, yeah, that's why I did this video. It was like, you know what? I bought a lot of, I got a lot of stuff today that's like, gaming and techie kind of stuff so like I was like why not make a video on it because um I don't make videos like there's only certain times a day I can make record like with this setup because it has to be really quiet um like if my kids are awake anything's awake like this thing will pick up everything and I have to try to edit it out it's not fun so I usually record at night when everybody's asleep and sometimes neighbors and stuff like that allowed anyway so it's actually pretty quiet right now but you can't hear anything that's because it's through my phone and not through that because that picks up a lot more, a lot better quality stuff. Um, but yeah, so that's pretty much it. Like, if you like this video, let me know. Leave a thumbs up. Um, I know there's probably only about 100 or 200 of you that are probably going to actually end up watching it because um, that's like the, the ratio, if you will. Um, but yeah, so streaming cross out tonight. I hope you guys are there. If you are, it's going to be on YouTube Gaming. I don't do Twitch because... I'll just answer this question now. I don't do Twitch because um, every time I watch Twitch videos, the the comments section, the chat and stuff like that, it's like a cesspool of filth. Like, it's just terrible. Like, the things people are saying, it's just like, oh my gosh, like, why are we doing this? So, um, as you know, like, I try to do family-friendly stuff. I have two kids that... I. I want them to be able to watch my videos, if that makes sense, because, like, I don't want to do something and not have my own kids watch it, because I feel like that's, I don't know, that's just how I am, I guess, um, so I try to be family friendly and things like that, um, but yeah, uh, like I said, if you like this, don't forget to leave a like, if you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe, and check out the other, check out the channels, check out what I have to offer, I have a lot of Astroneer, because that's what everybody likes, that's, like, my biggest pulling game right now, um, started doing Terror Tech, started doing Cross Out, started doing, um, uh, Slime Rancher again, No Man's Sky, Osiris New Dawn, things like that. So I've been trying to like broaden my horizon and not just do Astroneer because I was doing primarily Astroneer because that's what everybody wanted. Well, the content's getting low. Like there's there's little little left that I can do that I haven't already done. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna get this done. I'm gonna get it edited and like make it look semi decent. It probably looks terrible already, and I hope the volume and sound quality is not terrible. But, um, but yeah, so if you guys are watching this, thanks for watching to the end. That really helps out. And like I said, leave a like. If you have any comments, you want to see something more, if you want to see this more, let me know. If you want to see it less, let me know. This is not going to replace gaming videos. It's not going to take the place of a Let's Play or something like that. It's it's not going to do that. You know what? Why don't I just set this down? My gosh. Yeah. So it's not going to take the place of anything. This is just for funsies to like do myself because I like creating. I like making stuff. I like getting into Premiere and like trying to dig deep and stuff like that. Um. So you might see a lot of these 
You might see some more of these for like my California trip that I'm taking. Um, if you want to see, let me know. Let me know. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. You guys have a good day.